Eusebius of Caesarea is noted as the most important of the earlier fathers of the church. He is known for his belief in putting the logos and wisdom together. He wrote that the divine word therefore pre-existed and appeared. He states further that that intellectual and substantial wisdom, the living word, which in the beginning was with the Father before all creation, the first and only offspring of God. He further said the power and wisdom of God entrusted with the second rank of sovereignty and rule over all. Where did Eusebius get these ideas that the word was wisdom of Proverbs 8 and that wisdom existed with the Father before all creation. Where did he get this idea? He got this idea from Philo of Alexandria. He, he wrote about Philo in his book and he said that Philo was sublime and elevated in his views of the sacred scriptures. He also wrote that Philo became noted a man most distinguished for his learning not only among many of our own but of those who came from abroad. So clearly Eusebius believed in Philo's ministry, Philo's ideas. Now this is important because Philo taught many things including that the earlier uh, Christians in Alexandria were people who studied the sacred scriptures but they also believed in philosophy and they applied the allegorical method to their teachings and learnings of the Bible. This is Philo and he also taught that other things like that the earlier Christians of Alexandria they had apartments and within the apartments they had a place where they called the monasterium. So clearly Philo was talking about the early beginnings of the Catholic Church. So Eusebius writes about Philo and about how Philo describes all these things happen in Alexandria. And it looks at Philo with such a strong belief that Philo was correct. Now Eusebius plays an important part during the Council of Nicaea 325. For it was Eusebius who presented the creed that would be accepted by the Nicene Council and it would be backed up by Constantine the Emperor and it would be modified to so that everyone would agree but essentially most of what Eusebius wrote stayed with this Nicene Creed. This is what he wrote we believe in one God, the Father Almighty, maker of all things visible and invisible, and in one Lord Jesus Christ, the Word of God, God of light, light of light, life of life, the only begotten Son, born before all creation, begotten of God, the Father, before all ages. This is the contributions that Eusebius gave to the Catholic Church.